Welcome back guys. We are talking about CSI net suggestions and this video is to talk about the suggestions from the genetics chapter. Now from the genetics is the one of the most economic and most important chapter for cracking CSI and net because you know uh, they are going to ask you many questions from genetics for the group C as well as for group B and in all aspects in group B and C genetics is fully and completely analytical right they are going to ask you more math problems more of a mathematic arithmetic problems and you need to have a very clear understanding otherwise you can't answer any question from that right so that is very very important most of the part is you know conceptual so for that reason you need to have a very strong foundation of basic genetics which is also termed as Mendelism right so you need to understand the Mendelism a lot once you understand the Mendelism then you need to go for the non Mendelian inheritance pattern you can find all these videos in my channel link is provided here just below click it and you can find the link on the top also so click those link you you will find and it is redirected to the playlists that are designed for you for understanding all these topics in the non mendelian genetics in this part majorly this covers most of it now in the non mendelian part there will be you know uh, different other inheritance or ratios rather than the mendelian ratio like you know like incomplete dominance uh, then uh, what we say it is a uh, double double dominance and all this thing epistasis uh, multiple alleles polygenic inheritance there will be uh, you know, these are the examples of all the men non Mendelian type right and you need to understand all of them the basic fundamentals of all of them then you need to also understand the math the mathematical problems that they're going to ask they're going to ask you questions mathematical questions they want you to find out the phenotypic ratio of uh, the different cross you need to answer those questions right they may ask you different questions of you know probability questions you need to answer them and all of them is a part of this search so this is very very important in all aspects right and another thing here is the linkage that I haven't mentioned here linkage and crossing over right so linkage is again a part of non Mendelian type of inheritance and in linkage part you need to understand the problems you know problem about linkage pro problems about linked genes you need to find the distance between two genes and the name of the two genes that are present there they are going to ask you math questions about that that is called three point cross two point cross like that right so this is a very important part second thing you know you need to understand microbial genetics you know among microbial genetics this is also important and also math can come from there also and the example part here is you know the different way of uh, the chromosome and uh, not chromosome actually for microbes there are not no chromosome the genetic material exchange like you know transformation transformation transduction and conjugation conjugation transduction these are the types among them majorly important is the conjugation where you are having f plus plus mid f prime plasmid HFR strain majorly you need to know about the HFR strain and F prime strain what they are talking about what they mean for so these are the things you need to understand very clearly about and from the microbial genetics point of view right and you know how transformation occurs and all this is majorly conjugation and there is a type of math called HFR strain math problem you know that's called the interrupted mating now uh, I am also going to make videos on those topic it is not there present this time but but I'll be making it and putting the link here so you can find those math problems now the third is the human genetics in the human genetics perspective you need to understand about the polygenic inheritance multiple alleles you know inheritance of your skin color and height right and also you need to understand and talk about the different regulation of certain genes in certain extent with the environmental situations and all this and also majorly you know ABO ABO blood typing that is very very high pick for for CS and net throughout the years as well as uh, from this part pedigree is another very very important choice you need to learn pedigree analysis how to analyze pedigree and to find out what is the type of inheritance pattern of a disease that is provided including the fact you need to understand the maternal inheritance maternal inheritance right 
maternal inheritance means you know inheritance pattern of the genes from the previous generation to the next generation only via the maternal source like mitochondrial inheritance right so these are the examples and the type that you need to understand very very clearly because they're going to ask you analytical problems and finally the chromosome mutation and only actually it's from whole and whole lot of mutations mutation means you're going to find here you know two types of mutation you know uh, aberrations in numerical as well as uh, you know uh, what is that structural those two type of aberrations and among both of them how they actually originated what are the cause for this type of mutations that's called the chromosomal mutations similarly there are mutations called genetic mutation or genetic or gene mutations gene mutation or DNA mutation and that's also called as you know point mutation you need to understand what is point mutation you need to understand what are mutagens some examples of mutagens which are the causative agent for mutation mutagens like physical agents as well as chemical agents you need to understand all of them so this is a huge part genetics as you can see and they're going to ask you many things and I can't actually pick anything from here because I love genetics myself so I want you to learn everything about genetics it is not bad to learn everything so it is kind of everything that you need to know very clearly for the understanding now the students for hardcore microbiology or by uh, majorly I, I, I am microbiology people so that that's I know the syllabus that is present on all universities does not teach you genetics very well so you need to teach it for yourself my channel is always there with you so please click on the link and understand what's what's what you need to understand for CSIR thank you